The Shockers officially made Brian Green their next head baseball coach this afternoon. While this process has been contentious with Shocker Nation since Wichita State decided not to retain interim head coach Lauren Hibbs, I think it's important to note that Shocker legend Gene Stevenson was in attendance supporting the hire. Stevenson, for those of you that don't know, was the Shockers head baseball coach for 35 years. Also in attendance was WSU baseball great Mike Pelfrey. Pelfrey was the pitching coach on the last staff, which makes his appearance at this pretty interesting as well. And speaking of staff, here's new head coach Brian Green on hiring his assistant coaches and recruiting the players currently in the transfer portal. We've solidified uh, the roles, you know, just in terms of uh, three position coaches, two recruiters. I'll be in the middle of it and then uh, a pitching coach and a pitching assistant. How that shakes out in terms of a managerial position or which paid slots go where. Um, like I said, I interviewed the staff here, uh, first class pro. Uh, was very impressed and have a few more interviews and, and people to talk to and uh, but I know that we need to make a decision for our players uh, so we can put really everything in front of them and say look this is it what do you want to do and uh, and then that'll give me an opportunity to get my RV and the ones that are on the bubble I'll just go see them meet with them I'll plop that thing open and hopefully we can sell them and get them back here this hire also marks the third new head coach to be introduced by Wichita State Athletic Director Kevin Saul in the past three months. Earlier this spring, Saul also hired new men's and women's basketball coaches in Paul Mills and Terry Nooner. Saul says all three were the product of extensive nationwide coaching searches and that all three are taking over unique situations. The reason why we hired uh, Coach Mills and Coach Nooner and Coach Green is because they put uh, the organization and others before themselves. They're all very unique circumstances, unique situations, programs that are in different spots. There's financial components. So it's really not about putting Kevin Saul's fingerprint on the athletics department. That's not what it's about. It'll never be about that. It's not about me. It's about who we serve.